What's up guys, Shawnee Dogs here, and I have something really cool to show you guys. So a user on Reddit, full credit to him, Mr. Earthbound, he went digging deep into the Call of Duty Infinite Warfare game files, and he found reload animations for all four of the guns that I showed you just a few days ago. The MP28, the Mini LMG, the Hades, which is that MP5K remake, that's an energy weapon, and also the VR AR46. So let's hop straight into it, starting with the MP28. And my apologies, guys, I accidentally referred to this as a PPSH. I gave it a quick glance. I didn't even see that the ammo was on the side like that. This definitely is a Type 100, very similar to what was in World at War a hell of a lot of Call of Duties ago, but this thing looks awesome. It looks just like that original one, and this could be a cool addition to the game. I know these models look a bit rough, but as you can see, they're not quite finished yet. So moving on to the VR AR46, this thing, it doesn't look too special now. I'm sure they'll jazz it up before it gets put into the game. It kind of looks like a big block. It looks a little bit weird, but this is the gun that I'm looking forward to the most. It seems the most practical when you hip fire. It has a tight spread. That was one of the traits that it has, and it also shoots faster while aiming down the sight. So very desirable traits for assault rifles. Now this next one, the mini LMG, you're going to laugh when you see this reload animation because there basically isn't one. If you've ever played zombies in any of the most recent Call of Duties, you'll know that this minigun, whenever they give it to you, I'm sure this won't be a zombies only weapon, it has like 999 or 1000 bullets and you never reload it anyway, so you don't have to worry about that crappy reload animation. Now finally, here comes the mother load, the Hades. I was so surprised when I saw this reload animation. I wasn't even really expecting the gun to look quite like this as well. They definitely made it look futuristic. It is not the old MP5K we know and love. This is a futuristic Infinite Warfare MP5. And I gotta say, I don't know how I feel about exactly how the gun looks, but that reload animation looks really cool. It sort of reminds me of the Wonder Waffle if you've ever played Zombies. There's just something about it that's mesmerizing. I could watch this all day, but I don't wanna sit here and replay the same animation a hundred times for you guys. But those are all of the reloads for these new weapons. I don't know how I feel about all of this info being online. It seems a bit weird. I sort of like being surprised when they add new things into the game. This kind of ruins that feeling, but it does add hype when you see something cool. And now I'm definitely looking forward to whenever they put these in the game. I really want that Hades and the VR AR46. Not because of how it looks, the VR necessarily, but from what I read, it looks like it could be really amazing. But now I want the Hades, just based off that reload animation. And I mean, it's a new gun. There's a lot of hype around it. Everybody wants the latest and greatest. But now what I've got for you guys here is a gameplay from earlier today. This was my first game of the day. I was having some controller issues at the beginning. As you saw there, my controller disconnected. And this was while I was running off three hours of sleep so i was completely disoriented not in the mood to play at all just sort of playing to play the game and i don't know what was up my shot was just off i even paused the game to check if i had aim assist on because it was just so bad and i ended up switching to a k-bar because i was getting a little mad and a k-bar mixed with three hours of sleep makes for a really good gameplay. There's a lot of aggression and a lot of shaky shots, which makes for some close gunfights. It's really entertaining to watch. We were losing this game pretty much the entire time, and I managed to carry our team to victory at the very end in dramatic fashion, and we ended up with the W. Definitely hope you guys stick around. I will leave it in its raw nature, and that is going to be it for this video. If you do enjoy, please be sure to drop a like Comment down below with any thoughts or questions you may have. I want to hear your thoughts on these guns. My favorite, hands down, is that Hades. And as always, subscribe to the channel if you are new for some more great videos. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.
support is... 